Hi, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you. That depends on where you are watching us from right now. God bless you. You are welcome again to this platform. As you know, that this is a place that usually bring updates of issues that are happening around the world, those ones that are already available on the internet space. Thank you for always being with us. A couple of hours ago, I think two hours, three hours ago, I made a video where I review the past, the present, and the future, the way forward for Pastor Gabriel Amushan Ademola. And in that particular video, I made some statements, uh, things that Pastor Gabriel should do right now, because the situation right now is so tense that even beyond what we might even imagine. And I said in that particular video that I pray that uh, this issue of Muba, I'm sorry, issue of um, Amuidin should come to a stop and because of a video that I said I saw. And as at the time I was make, making that video, I the, the, the full, I've not seen the full version of that part, a particular video where uh, Muidin was talking about his wife and Pastor Gabriel. And when I woke up, uh, this morning, I saw that same video at uh, the full version of this video. And I think it is time for every one of us to just uh, do something about this issue of Pastor Gabriel. Pastor Gabriel Amusa made a lot of errors. But I think it is time that uh, we just time to do something. Let's have mercy upon this man. Either we like it or not, there are some lives that he has touched. I think it is time for us, especially we bloggers, to do something about this thing. This thing is going viral once again. And in that video, I made this statement. I said, who are those people that are making that videos? Why are they interested in making this kind of video? We know that Pastor Gabriel made a lot of mistakes, but I think... Uh, we should put Pastor Gabriel in the position. If he happens to be our brother, if he happens to be our husband or our pastor, we said we know he has made a lot of mistakes. We know that he has made mistakes, really. A lot of mistakes. But I think it is time for us, at least, let us have mercy on this man. Now, I want us to see this video that I said I saw where Muidin was again saying some things. Can we say exposing secret? Can we say this thing has set, set up? But most of us think that uh, Muidin is uh, having issue of making is having um, mental issue. But I think this guy, that that there is more to these things. There are more things that we have not seen about this matter. Yes. Pastor Gabriel, Gabriel has fall a lot of and a lot of people are disappointed. Yes, I know. But let us see this video. Changes 
Facebook where one statement to my comment against me now. Something is behind it. Something is behind it. Mother, my people, I believe you are kind of you. I want to want to want to want to want to so, comment <laughs> Agbala yes guys you are welcome and i believe you have all watched that video yes in that particular video uh let me just give you the summary for those people that doesn't understand yoruba Muidin was seen uh, and someone was at, at the background asking some questions and um the, that particular person asked him about um where is is he is, is, is going to stay now and according to he said he doesn't have anywhere to stay that he'll be living within that market body market in a pardon to be precise and uh, she he also makes some allegation against pastor gabriel about his wife that he perceived there is a uh, there is a uh undue relationship between his wife and uh, pastor gabriel and that person has a question here how do you sure 
you uh, catch them? He said, yeah, he, he could not really answer that if he caught both of them. But he said, based on what is happening and based on what people saw on the uh, on social media, that the reaction of his wife shows that uh, the wife is having something to do with uh, Pastor Gabriel. That how will his wife always uh, stand against his wish, always stand against his will? And we could see in that view that the wife won't even... I wanted to stay behind with uh, Pastor Gabriel. So, based on that, he want to conclude that there is a an undue relationship, a uh, undue relationship between Pastor Gabriel and his wife. That is what he said. And also, he made some allegation against Pastor Gabriel about the house that is building for people on that ground. Uh, the house that none of them uh, has the document for the house. For the house, and uh, he, he also said, uh, Pastor Gabriel says, Come, and um, that was all what we could see in that video. And uh, he said, He doesn't have anywhere he's staying right now. And according to him, that he doesn't have, he doesn't want to have anything to do with his wife any longer, that he'll be staying around in the market. Yes, that is the situation of things, and the way things are right now, I think. Uh, this issue is um, is uh, is is not over yet. You know, in the previous video that I made, I said I just pray that uh, that issue will stop there. And uh, I begin to wonder and I begin to uh, fear when I saw that video. The video you just watched. You know, I have not seen the uh, I've not seen the whole of the video. Then I just saw I uh, I think about thirty minutes of or five minutes. Of that video that was what i saw that was what i i could see on the internet space before i made that show and i said i just pray that that uh video will not fly and the way it is now the video has fly because uh the platform that i took that video from the video is having about seven hundred thousand views in just two three hours so it means that this matter has become a matter that uh, everybody is aware of ah, and the um, point i want to make now is that the bloggers have seen another issue to work on and i'm just begging you know meeting has given every one of them every one of us the place that is living so everybody can just go to that market and look for me and they begin to do various interview various interview for um Meeting and uh, also, I'm also bothered about the person that is also making the videos, do the interview in the background for uh, Mudin. And the, my previous video, I was asking who is that person who made that interview, who posted it on social media, and those are the questions that we need to ask. Yes, Pastor Gabriel has made a lot of mistakes, which I too I have stood against that. It's only beating an adult, beating a man that is older than him. It is unacceptable in every in every sense of it. I stood against that. I did not accept that. That is too bad of Pastor Gabriel to do. A pastor doesn't have that right to build to beat the member of the church. It's only those ones that are adults older than you. So you are not you are their father in the law. You are not. I flogged that you are not to beat them. So that was a great mistake that I made and some mistake in the past. I think I think said when she took him from the street, he should have looked for people that know more about street life to uh, uh, to do a kind of therapy for Mwidin. These are the things that I stated in that, that video that he needs to have people that know more than him, directors, managers, that can, manage, that, that can manage things for him in that foundation, in that ministry. I have made it, that video and uh, all the error, I have stated it. Pastor Gabriel made a lot of error. But as it is now, as it, as, as it is now, I want people, please and please, just have mercy on this man. There's nothing we, we, we are going to get in our uh, destroying him more what you have done 
what the internet have done i think it is over the video is already there the internet cannot forget but let us just talk let us just do the needful let us take bra uh bra gabriel amusa as our brother as our brother if our brother means they will not kill him we have scolded him yes every one of us scolded him we have uh, uh we have scolded him so it is time for us to uh, bring him back let us let us just do something that's going to bring him back we have stated all his mistakes but i think it is now that we we should do something yalage courtroom show is doing great thing i pray that god will be with that and other people too anti anti please let us come to the rescue of this man uh, I like you, I'm sorry, you have done your best, and I think you can see do more. Mama is about Mama, please, no matter your about our sorrow, that we that things can be resolved. It is every one of us we have one mistake or the other that we have made in the past, and we are not killed. Don't don't let us kill this man. Let us bring him back again. Let us hold him back again. He has fallen. But it is time to bring him back. It is time to hold him and to stand on his feet again. <clears throat> There's no benefit we are going to derive. If that ministry die, if that foundation crash, there is no benefit that we are going to derive from it. A lot of people have been blessed by it. A lot of people have been are brought to life by it. So that is the aspect I want us to look into. So please and please uh, let us res rescue Pastor Gabriel Amusa. And let us do the needful. Uh, me then also, I want people to do a kind of um, let us uh, reinstate this guy. That market, we 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 do a kind of we damage him the more. So it is time to just rise up and do something. And I know what me did did must have been to some underground um, people are underground doing that. All that he has done so he also beat on those things that he have he have seen around pastor gabriel and i think one of the things that made him to succumb to all this pressure was because the issue of his wife so these are the things i want us to look into and please let us do the needful so thank you for joining us let us share this video let us tag these people that i've mentioned let us all stand up and restore our man, our pastor, and our brother back to his feet. He has learned his mistake. I believe he must have learned his mistake. Thank you. God bless you. If today is your first time joining us on this platform, please kindly subscribe to our channel and make sure you on your notification button. So anytime we drop a new video like this particular one, You'll be notified and to all our returning subscriber guys god bless you for always joining us so the next time when i'll be coming again for more updates on this particular issue or other matter i want to say god bless you and please stay safe bye bye